We're fighting like cats and dogs. <laughs> Honey, we're on our Airbnb extravaganza, and this is our place. R is in Richard. I don't know why I said Richard, but it's the most delicious restaurant ever. And we're gonna tell you all about it. Look at that cute little lit up patio. Where's the sun? Oh, right there. Our place. It's our place, and we've been saying our house. Oh. <laughs> really? Yeah. It is our place. Uh huh. Well, it's on there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. Hello. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Just him. I did, did. You did. Oh. You're about to break us. Welcome to vacation day one. <laughs> well, we've already actually been through a whole day. We have. And he refused to show you the place I dreamed of. The whole uh, The happy place? It was too cold. The pretty place. The pretty it was, place. But it was still beautiful. It's called the pretty place in Cleveland, South Carolina. <clears throat> it's the place. It's a YMCA camp and you've probably seen it on social media. It's a cross. It's like a cross with a huge um, backdrop. I'll try to include an image of it. Uh, here. Okay, it's much. a place that I've been wanting to go for a really long time, but just never taken. It's like two and a half hours from where we live. And um, it was kind of on the way here, which here. We took about an hour detour, but it was worth it for me. Oh, it was fine by me because I had an hour nap on the way back. Um, we're in Greenwood, South Carolina, which I think I told y'all about in the Jersey Mike's video, what we were doing. Don't go researching it because you won't find anything because there's yeah, nothing here. Right. I mean, it's we literally just come to do nothing. Like we literally just sat at dinner and both played our Wizard of Oz game and had the time of our lives. We were we were that couple who you look and you think that they hate each other because they're on their phones. But really, we have the best relationship known to mankind. <laughs> Having the time of our lives. So we drove today. We went to the pretty place. Then we came here. She took a nap. I took a 45 minute walk. We reconvened, went to our place. Now we're going to Publix to get a piece of cake. Going back, watching the Casey Anthony documentary. Let's see. With our Bath and Body Work candle that we brought. Yep. Do they have a lighter there? We didn't look to see if they have wood. They usually have wood, but we didn't check. It was covered. So I'm assuming we do not have a lighter, but we don't have a stove either. We can get one at Publix. Yeah. Um. Well, fine. And there's where we're going to go tomorrow. Is that TJ Maxx over there? think so and that would probably yeah because there's yeah. that starbucks we go yeah. to y'all literally the points of interest at this place that we go to are and there's our house yeah tj maxx chick-fil-a starbucks starbucks our place the end and then we literally. just sit in the airbnb also mpk that tj maxx really is good we but we put it on a pedestal so tomorrow it'll probably be really terrible which i won't be mad about because i don't need to buy anything I but i do look forward to coming to this tj maxx um, and I've never been to a Publix before. Oh, it's just we've never went to the one. It's down just here. like an overly nice Kroger. There was a Lidl back there, which is like an Aldi. Yeah, you did tell me about that. This place literally is nothing special at all to the common folk. Right. To me. And me. This is now my fourth time here. Third, maybe third time here. Maybe third. No. I don't know. I think probably this is fourth. fourth. Yeah. Yeah. Shelby and Josh, me and you have come twice and at least this. Yeah. And then she's maybe been here. you're fifth. Maybe. We came just me and you when it was hot, just me and you when it was cold. This time, Shelby, Shelby and Josh, Josh, so maybe. I think this is five. I've been here six or seven, eight times. It's great. I mean, I oh, it. China Garden. So fun. Um, it's just a place where you don't have expectations. We know what we're going to do, which is nothing. Yeah. And I really just needed a brain detox. And it's more so like instead of let's go so and so, so and so, there, 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 there. It's like, well, let's lay around, scroll our phones, and yeah. let our brains turn to literal mush, like in a good way. Yeah. Where we're both going crazy 24 7, shows me. <laughs> 3 p.m. on the couch. <laughs> um, oh, and didn't we go to, I think the Ult is kind of that way. There's Smoothie King, too. Oh, fun. I think we're touring Johnson City right now, literally. Oh, it's kind of trying to spit snow, honey. It has been very cold. I'm hoping for less um, less wind tomorrow, maybe. I've been watching lots of YouTube videos about cake, so I've got cake on the brain. She's gonna get a slice of key lime, key lime and I'm gonna get a piece of cake. And we're not gonna get groceries for the Airbnb because we're literally only gonna be here like 48 hours and yeah. I don't need it because if it's there, it'll get eaten. Oh, yeah. 
Okay, we see you in there if there's no music. I forgot to tell y'all about the, <clears throat> the game on my phone that I'm obsessed with. I know it makes me sound like a mammal, but honey, at this point, are you shocked? It's the Wizard of Oz Match 3 game that you can download on the App Store. It's so fun. Is I'm on level 100. She says it's like the Wizard of Oz version of a Candy Crush. I never played Candy Crush, so I can't confirm nor deny. I can confirm. But don't you love it? Yeah, I love it. Do you like it more than Candy Crush? Were you obsessed with Candy Crush too? Uh, yeah, for a little while. Um, okay, there's no music, so I will show you the bakery. Um, if y'all have a Publix in your area, you know it's just like a really nice grocery store. But we don't have one. So, well, we do have one in Johnson City, but honey, a ain't Publix? nobody got some. No, we don't. Yeah, we do. A Publix? Yes. In Johnson City? Yeah. I just never go to it because it's 30 minutes away. Of course, now that I'm in Johnson City, a lot more. Um, okay. She's making sure that there's not, that there is a Johnson City Publix. Oh look! Oh, it's a miniature one. Honey, we, there, if there's one thing we love, it's a uh, ice cream cake, and that one is very cute too. Hello, would you like a tour of our Airbnb? Honey, some people can't get away for vacations. Um, here's my bed. It's an air bed, propped up on the coffee table and the end of the couch, and it makes a perfect queen size bed for me. Love that. This is the first time he's done that. Yeah, usually I've just slept on the couch, but I had that airbed from when I went to New Year's Eve with my friends, and I just decided to bring it because it was in the car. Mm -hmm. Honey, we've got a little kitchenette. Yeah. I'll show you the view tomorrow. It's literally the lake, and it's beautiful. The lake is right there, which the lake is down because it's winter. But. Yeah. Um, we've got a toilet, a shower, a sink. We've got our lakes. Is it Lakeside Morning? Yes. yes. Lakeside Morning. The light is behind the door in my bedroom. Bath and Body Works candle. Behind the door. On the wall. That's a bad place. Yeah. And here's Kiki's room. <laughs> I love these uh, green shades. The whole room is, the whole house is tiny, but honey, it's oh. our literal version of paradise. Oh my gosh. We're getting ready to watch the Casey Anthony, Where the Truth Lies. Penny, would you like to tell me anything else? Um, no, because I'm excited to have absolutely nothing to do. I'm excited to not do my hair. Probably will never put makeup on one single time. My hair will be in this bun. Oh. I just got out of the shower. I won't wash my hair until I get back home. The end. I'm done with my In the Aztec blanket. Oh, yeah. And there's my little storage. I can't believe that. That is like... What? He usually just sleeps on the couch when we're here because this couch is humongous. Yeah. But if the we bed? Have a king size bed, we will sleep in the same bed. Yeah. But we are too territorial. We flip flop yeah. and we don't. And I'm always afraid that I'm going to wake somebody up. Um, I got this for my coffee in the morning. I need to get the Keurig out before she goes to bed so I'm not rattling around. I've got this to put in my coffee to make it stronger because it's Keurig. I know we've got some peanut MMs and popcorn for later. This is the key lime pie from Publix that we're currently tearing into. And what else is I going to show them? I guess that's it. It's the whole thing, honey. I got these. They were on sale at Publix. Uh, buy one, get one free. And honey, when I get back home, I'm doing good. We're both going to do better. We are because we're going to go on a cruise. We're going on a cruise and we want to have beach bodies. Here's beach all my stuff. Bodies. Here's my jacket. Um, so sorry for this short vlog, but uh, I may combine it with tomorrow. We'll see because we've not really recorded that much. So we'll check in tomorrow, honey. Because it really doesn't need a part two. Excuse me. Home slippy. <laughs> Not even at your home. Good morning. Honey Mackenzie is fast asleep. Here's the outside of our little bungalow. I'm going to the car to get my big Stanley cup for coffee. But I just wanted to show you our digs. Oh, my poor car is covered in salt from the snow. They've only got little bitty coffee cups in there and that just does not work for me. So. This it is. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go make my coffee come alive then we're gonna go run for about an hour 
and then I'll check back in with you. It's cold, right up my alley. This may be a whole separate video because I, I would assume this is going to take a long time. Hello, 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 y'all. Honey, we're in the floor of the Airbnb because we went to, in my opinion, in our opinion, the world's best TJ Maxx. Yeah. Um, and we're going to do a haul. We have everything under my makeshift airbed combo here. And um, we'll show you what we got in no particular order. I'll just pull it if it's yours. Okay. You can talk about it. If it's mine, I will. Uh -huh. First thing I've grabbed... Well, I got two of these. I couldn't decide the color. Mackenzie was like, they're $7, get both. I've never used this kind, but I've been intrigued by them. It's the metal mesh for the Apple Watch band. They were $7.99. One is like a deep jade green, and one is like a rose gold. That jade green is one of my favorite colors. I know. I can't wait to see it. In fact, I can't wait to take this out and try it on my watch. So, it's magnetic. It's cheap. And sometimes I just get sick of having one Apple Watch band. So... I gave these a try. Speaking of jade green. Oh, she was the most excited about that. Does it not work? I tried it in the store and it did. Maybe it's, oh, oh it, it was, was caught. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. For the I bathroom. have like an open trash can in my bathroom. Do you know what I mean when I say mm -hmm. that it doesn't have a lid? I hate that. I hate looking at tissue paper and stuff. Yeah. And this will match my bathroom perfectly. Yep. Love it. With a little pedestal. Oh, I love the feel of those. I have the big claw clips, but I wanted to clip half of my hair back instead of the whole thing up in a big claw clip. So I just got little ones. I can put it over here when you can. And they're super cute. They're like very, they're almost like rubberized. I got three, six, eight, ten of them for $7.99. All different colors. Um, I got one of these because I always need more plugs in an outlet. So I love this because one becomes three. I need this in my bedroom because of my electric blanket. It's a long story, but anyway, needed that. It was five dollars. No thanks. You can get these at the Dollar Tree, but they go bad too quick. So, honey, I went with the Energizer. Hopefully, it would last a little bit longer. This was an impulse buy. Most of this stuff was for me. This was Clarence. I love the Little Mermaid. My favorite Disney princess. Always has been. Always will be. And this was on clearance. First off, it has whew, her silhouette on the back, part of your world on the front, with a little shell on the top. And this matches my coffee bar completely, so I won't use this. It's not microwave safe. This will just be... And it was on clearance mm -hmm. for 13 And it's right done. So that will just sit on my it's little coffee cute. bar as a little decoration. You could put something in there. I just don't know what. No, I mean, you've got the top, so you don't need to put anything in there. Ow, falling. Um... So, randomly, months ago, I stumbled upon this brand at TJ Maxx called Dream Stories. And it's a comforter. And it's the softest comforter you could ever imagine. And then I found, last week, the sheets. And they changed my life. So, I got a second set. I got gray last week. This week, I got white. And it comes with the sheets plus four pillowcases, which I really love. Oh, really? Love. Yeah. Ooh. Um, and I got the cream color because it matches the comforter I have right now. It's like a khaki. Mm-hmm. $24 for the and best sheets so ever. Soft, oh my gosh. And the more you wash them, the softer they become. For so that. I got that. I need this. Why do you need a strainer for fudge? Because when you make fudge and you put the powdered sugar in there, if you don't sift oh, it, it, it gets, gets lumpy. clumpy. I didn't have a sifter. The ones at Dollar Tree were too small. This one was $3 and it's big. So I needed this. Okay. Sometimes I do need a sifter for random things. Um, I got sugar-free. I was looking for sugar-free peppermint in the Tarani, but this is Belgian cookie, and this is the next best thing. Wonder what what's Belgian cookie? Belgian cookie is like, like cookie butter, butter. Cookie? cookie butter, like oh. speculoos, like oh, really? Delta cookie. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. And you put that in your coffee. Uh huh. Um. Okay. There's that. Six dollars. So that was a bargain because I think I paid. $12 for the sugar-free peppermint from the Tarani website. I usually don't buy clothes from TJ Maxx, but this was soft. <laughs> Singing our Wizard of Oz game. This was soft, and it's just a casual little, it has a hood, which Tyler hates, but um, it has the zip. I don't think I would mind a hood like that because it would lay back more. Yeah, it has this little zip right here. The good. color's adorable. Yeah. It's like an army color. green. Just comfy little thing. Who got that? 
Um, I found, so even though I have many, many pair of joggers. I love these. I, the, the, my favorite pair of joggers that I own are these, which are Kenneth Cole Reaction. Um, I have Lululemon joggers that I paid uh, watts for. I paid $100 for these joggers. These are, those were, these are 20, yeah, these are $20 and I would pick them hands down over any of my expensive pair. They fit me well. They are very super soft. They're tight fitting on my legs, which I like, but not super tight fitting. And it says that they're originally $80, Probably which are. it really says that on there. Uh -huh. I just love these. And this is in like a burnt red, like burgundy. I don't have any like that. And I was thrilled to find this. Mm -hmm. Like this TJ Maxx is truly our holy grail of all TJ Maxx's. It is. I feel like I'm just pulling things out from the cosmos. I got this baking sheet. I like how it's like speckled. Mm -hmm. Really pretty gold and what? I don't know what color that is. Like mm. a turquoise gray. I only have one baking sheet. But I like that this would have like the little cooling rack yeah. thing too. So for cookies. Mm -hmm. like that way you can bake them and cool. Yeah. Ten dollars. He makes fun of me. I'm bad about Tupperware, y'all. These I take to work all the time. And then sometimes I just throw them away. So anytime I'm at TJ Maxx or Ross or something, I never go to Ross, I don't know why I said that. Eight dollars for twenty of these. Yeah. So so it's probably sometimes worth it because it would take a lot to get those clean, especially if they sit there for a long time. Yeah. These really are cute, and I'm interested to get your thoughts on it. This was a need. It is a set of 20 reusable kitchen towels. Um, I have decorative kitchen towels, but I don't have ones that, like, if I spill something, I reach for paper towels. Mm -hmm. So I'm hoping that this, it was $10 for 20 of them. Made to replace single-use paper towels. So... Yeah. And you just machine wash the, the them. The patterns are adorable. Yeah. I'm anxious to see. Um, This is one of my favorite brands from TJ Maxx. Let me show you. It's denim and flowers. Their stuff fits me well. And I figured that I can wear this in the summertime with shorts, even to a closing because it's just plain and it's fancy enough to not be like a casual t-shirt. Do you ever hate this? I love that. I to like a closing yeah. or like to a sh to a house showing yeah a cute little spring outfit so i got that it was eight dollars in this little brown and white striped can't wait to wear that i don't know what this means it says they become more absorbent after the first yeah, few washes know. and will shrink to fit a standard size paper towel roll holder. i don't know what that means either i've read that and was confused um i bought this wet brush shine enhancer because I need another full-size brush that I can put in my toiletry bag. I have a little mini brush that I got from the Dollar Tree, but it just ain't it, y'all. So I got this one, and it's in like turquoise and gold. I'll use this as like my main hairbrush and put the hairbrush that I have in the bathroom in my toiletries bag. Isn't that so cute? That mm -hmm. turquoise and the gold. It matches my baking dish. I absolutely love it. Mm-hmm. Love it. Oh, it's got different bristles. Yeah, it says something like it promotes shine. So, honey, we'll see. There's not much going on right now up there. That's trash. I bought this because I feel like we're in a world now where you need both of these on one plug. You need the normal USB for your older Apple products slash some of your current, and then you need that one for your oh. newer stuff. So this one has both, so I could plug in my iPad cord or my Boom. USB one at the same time. So this would be good to take to like New York when you don't have a lot of plugs. Um, and it was 10 bucks. So I got that. That was kind of a need. I got this br uh, boar's hair bristle brush for my beard. Because, honey, the only brush that will comb my beard hair is like this instead of like that. I don't know why, mm. but it is. <clears throat> so, hate it, but had to have it. Because my other one was about failing. Um... I got this razor. I felt like I had heard about it somewhere, but then again, I have no idea. Um, but it's the Flamingo razor. Really, it was just gold and this um, mm -hmm. lilac color. And I thought it was cute. It has five blades. It has a shower holder. And just got a, I need a razor. So. I wonder if you could like buy the heads. I'm sure you can. 
if you use them all. Of course, Lord, how long would it take you to go through five of those? Yeah, right. And so this was only seven ninety nine for five extra blades. Okay, I knew he was going to make fun of this. No, I love the cheetah. I, for those of you who are just watching, I am over mental health at our county jail. And so I put encouraging quotes in my office. This says, life is tough, but so are you. With cheetah print. And it's cheetah print. Hello. Mm. This was five bucks. I love that everything. I made her buy this. <clears throat> this is my favorite hair care brand. It's Amika. But you have some of their stuff, don't you? No, I just used it at your house that one time. Mm. It's called Bust Your Brass, which I think is hilarious. And it's a cool blonde repair conditioner. And honey, it's it is purple purple. purple. Mm -hmm. I mean. I'm excited to use that. Purple. And that's an expensive product. It's a salon product. Mm, and it always smells I the same. I smell it. It always has the same smell no matter what the product is. Mm. Yeah, love it. Yeah, so that'll be nice to. Oh, love these. Honey, in the wintertime, yeah. you can't find these not on mine or her body. Yeah. These soft touch socks. These are mimois. Aka okay, Mimi. And they're just super soft and little fuzzy socks. Yep. Um, I don't like the grippers on the bottom, so these don't have the grippers. Mm -mm. Do you like the grippers? No. They get on my nerves. Oh. And then these I just bought. <clears throat> I like to go to Aldi. This was a two pack. Is that one or two? One. Okay, so that's a one pack for 99 cents. This was a two pack for $1.79. When you go to Aldi, if you don't want to pay for bags, you have to take your own. So, look how cute. To Super go to cute. Aldi, those are. Yeah. So, I just got those to take with me when I go do my Aldi runs. And, honey, I got two more things. Um, I got this cute little popcorn bucket for two bucks. It's got all kinds of little, I don't know. It's just not your standard popcorn thing, which I loved. And I ordered a new popcorn maker that Mystery recommended to me. And I'm super excited to try it. We need to do a thumbnail. Well, let me hold something. Um, I got a new popcorn maker from Amazon and I'm excited to use it and I wanted to have something to put it in. And this is like the perfect size for mm -hmm. me because the big one is too much popcorn. The small ones are too small. So this was like a medium size, which I love. And my last item was this cloud clear acrylic pop socket. I'm going to put it on the back of my phone case, which I can't show you because you're recording, but Honey, we, me and her both cannot survive without a pop socket. No. That's just. You people who carry your phone around with a pop socket. I don't understand. I just don't understand. It's one of those things that where if you don't have one, just don't have one because you'll never be able to go without it. So if you get one, you have to be able to commit for life yep. because you'll never be without one. Y'all, that's it. We did not buy too many impulse things. No. A lot of these are needs. I know some of y'all are probably laughing at that. Um. Okay. I got to get up. This my feet. Yeah. Oh, cute. cute. Don't, oh, what kind of a shot is that? Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Love you and I mean it. Anything else you want to tell them? Nope. Can't wait to go take a nap. Well, Good we night. had a lackluster experience at dinner, but we did find Shipley's Donuts. I've never had this place, but I have heard that it's delicious. Nobody's here, which I love. Oh, it was oh, close. Y'all, the most incredible thing happened. She was so nice. It was almost, it was five minutes before closing, which we didn't know or we no. wouldn't have gone in. No. Because that's just how we are. She was so nice. We were just being very talkative with her. And she was like, you know what? I'm just going to give you guys a bunch of donuts for free. So we have a, an assortment of free donuts from Shipley's. It's that's like an eclair. What devil, is devil's, devil's food, food. Cherry filled. Cream filled. Cream filled. Pink. No clue. Love it. Oh, that was so oh, nice. Oh, so nice. She was precious. Oh, sweet angel. Oh, and my the, lord. <laughs> That's a cream cheese roll. Yeah. Apple fritter. Apple fritter. Oh, um, we can have these for breakfast. Yeah. Blueberry cake. Whatever. That one looks delicious. Yeah. Yum. Okay. Honey, we'll try them in a second. Line to get a Starbucks. And in the meantime, we're going to try a donut. What? We were just trying no, to just smell it. distinguish what it was. Yeah. I got a Starbucks earlier. It's a long story that I'm not even going to explain. Yeah. <laughs> Are you, what's happening? Like, does this need to be good? That need, both those need to. That and that. Need to be thrown away, yeah. Hold on, y'all. You can hear my Starbucks order.
can I do a venti soy misto with sugar-free vanilla syrup, please? napkins in the dash. Don't need to say that's all. That's it. Thank you. That one was pretty good these have been sitting out all day she told us that which is part of the reason she gave them to us for free so they're basically day old donuts but uh -huh. but but hand sanitizer is a mess you hate it <laughs> for she, a free donut it's really good she hates it <laughs> come on try the devil's food hey. doll baby doll baby hoskins mm -hmm. is there anything in the middle or is it just chocolate How is it? Bum. I already tell it's just dry. No? I'm not complaining. Can't wait to hear it in the comments. Look how giant. That's Hold on. huge. It's the size of my head. Literally. I do like this. Okay. What's this one? The joke's on you. It's the good cream. Oh. I want to buy that. Mm -hmm. I thought it was going to be pudding, y'all, and I don't do pudding filled donuts. <clears throat> I'm getting this bite, then you can have it. I want to have that bite. With the puffed up right there. Mm. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh. Mm -hmm. That's the winner. The cream in that tastes like marshmallow fluff. That's what she said. It was like a marshmallow filling. Mm. <clears throat> oh my. That's delicious. That's really, really, really good. Can you mm -hmm. give me a napkin when mm -hmm. you have a chance, honey? Mm. The filling of that is delicious. Yeah. Woo! So I'm getting this coffee. It's eight o'clock. It feels like it's midnight. It does. Um, but I'm not going to have it until tomorrow. The Airbnb has Keurigs, but they're the very small, weird, single-use Keurig that I hate. And so, I'm just sticking with what I know and getting a Starbucks so that I can heat up in the microwave. So hefty. I want to look at the other ones. No, I told you my hair was going to look like this. Stay true in the statement. She did warn us. The apple fritter is also, also this the size biggest of my thing. head. Oh, Lord, hold on. Oh, I, I gotta go, y'all. I gotta use my phone for payment. Y'all, look at my friends. <laughs> at the Airbnb, there has little, there's little food. They're eating. There's Mackenzie over there. Honey, it's our last morning. We gotta check out. Look at these little cuties. Michelle from Chickens by the Lake. This reminds me of... Um, Lord, what's his name? Jethro. Do you guys know Jethro? Jethro Brooks? I don't think they know him, Michelle. Have y'all ever been to Canada? Honey, here we are. Usually this is all water. But I guess in the wintertime it's low. There's our duck friends next door. Uh oh! They heard daddy. This is where my heart is most at peace. That's so dramatic, but I mean that. These chairs are new. Mm -hmm. creepy. It's very calm here, honey. Got the boat you can rent. They have a jet ski. They have a little miniature putt putt course up there that's like four holes. It's 
It's my preference to be here in the winter just because I love winter in general. Hi. Oh, them coming for a swim. Honey, they had their breakfast, now they're going to work it off. Come on down, everybody. <laughs> Go on. You think they're going to get in the water? Oh, yeah. Did they get cold? Mm -mm. Honey, they've got lots of fat and feathers. Whoa, <laughs> look. Yeah, they're going to do it. Them feet are so orange. Uh oh. Uh -oh. oh. Oh, I'm just getting a drink. Oh, oh. to wash down the breakfast. And yeah. here comes Leroy. <laughs> Somebody's getting drunk. Well, y'all, thanks for coming along for this journey. I gotta get this video up. There's the uh, very cute subdivision that I walked around in the other day, yesterday. Anything else you'd like to add? Until next time. Oh, Lord, I had it on Zoom. Three. Oh, God. Honey, I told y'all, day three. Same with me. I think we're going to try to find something to eat on our way back. I'm trying to put it onto the galaxy. Love y'all. Mean it. I'll get you updated on the sweatshirts. It's happening. I'm, I'm talking to Con soon. So, love you. Bye.